In this video, I'm going to show you how I designed this wavy fin on this specific lure. And as you can see, the fin has a straight profile when it's closer to the center. But when we move away from the center, the profile turns into a wavy form. Uh, let's change to a different angle, you'll see better. Like this. So how do I do it? And also I will show you how to cut the mold for this because uh, the profile, the, the fin profile is not a flat surface. So we have to somehow create the wavy surface first so we can cut the mold for that. Let's get started. So to create this wavy fin, we will use the loft feature. Uh, so loft is basically extruding from one profile to the other. So here we create one profile first. So make it a uh, two millimeter. Do uh, like a um, hundred. And then So we make a rectangular as the cross section as, as the straight part of the fin. And we also need to create the center line of that cross section. We will use that to extrude to a wavy line to make a surface and use that as the cutting tool when we cut the mold. So we are done with this. Now let's draw the other side of the profile. So first we need to do an offset plan. Let's do a... Okay. Now draw the wavy form from that on that plan. So first we draw the center line of that wavy curve. Start from here and we have to pass the center of the beginning of that profile of the flat profile. And uh, stretch it out a little bit, finish. So now we have this curve, we will do offset to create the, the cross section of that wavy profile. So do this, do two offset, and another one, minus two offset. And we need to create some closed profile because this part is not closed so we need to make in two lines two vertical lines create two vertical lines to close this wavy profile so now it's closed say finish so now let's extrude from this profile actually we can select two from this long profile and to, oh, actually, sorry, my bad. We are not going to use extrude. We are going to use loft because we need to extrude to a different shape. So loft from this to, not the profile. Okay, and then to this two. So this is the wavy fin, one side straight, the other side wavy. So now we have this wavy body, we need to cut it to the shape we like. So again, 
draw the profile for that. So let's say I want it to be something like a ear shape. Now draw a line to close this profile. Say finish. Then we have this close form profile. And we will use the extrude feature to cut it. So we say two sides. Make sure we cover the whole thing. And this one. We don't need that much over there. So we will change to intersect after this. OK, so intersect, say OK. So we have this shape. And you can see one side is straight, the other side is wavy. Okay, that's it for the wavy fin. Now we need to cut the mold. So to do that, we will make a block and then create the surface, the center surface of this wavy fin, and then use that surface to cut the block. Actually, we are going to do the surface first. So hide this thing and show the profile sketch three. We can hide that first so now switch to the surface workspace and again there's a loft it's basically extrude one profile to the other oh actually oh this is okay okay so ooh, my dog is mad I don't know what happened maybe the mailman is here Anyway, so create this profile. Say OK. And now go to top, create the block. So I need to create a block for the mold. Mold. And now extrude, switch back to the solid workspace, extrude this profile, two sides, make sure it covers, it covers the, the whole thing. I don't know why my OK doesn't become active until I rotate it a little bit. Anyway, so I create this block. Now I need to cut out the thin body from this block. So combine, select target body is the block. And the tool is the thin body. And then cut, cut it. And also I want to keep the tool. So I will have the thin body after the cut. Say OK. OK. Now hide the thin body. So you can see the block. We already cut out the thin from the block. Now we need to split the block. Split. And then body split is this thing. Splitting tool is the surface here. Say OK. OK, now it's done. You can see we create the mold. We cut the mold in half along this wavy surface. And put the fin back on. Fin and the bottom mold and the top mold.
So there you have it. How to create the wavy fin and the mold for that. So after this is done, we can create the rest of the body of a lure, whatever you want to make, and uh, and the rest of the mold. We can just do it regularly, split from the middle. So that's how you do it. And you can see here the mold I have is combined from two parts. This part is the one I just show you how to do it, and the rest is just regular split it from the middle mold. Alright, thanks for watching.